Hydrophilic versus Hydrophobic. Brought to you by my book of chemistry. Before we discuss hydrophilic and hydrophobic, let's find out where these words come from. The words hydrophilic and hydrophobic both have a Greek origin. In Greek, hydro means water, H2O, and philic or phile means love. Therefore, hydrophilic means water loving. For example, Astrophile means a person who loves stars, astronomy. Wow! A cinephile is a person who is fond of the cinema or the movies. Now the opposite of hydrophilic is hydrophobic. In Greek, hydro means water and phobic or phobia means fear. Therefore, hydrophobic means water-fearing. For example, arachnophobia means fear of spiders. Nomophobia is a recently created word meaning fear of being without your mobile phone or being unable to use the mobile phone due to a low signal or low battery power. Did you know that over 50% of mobile phone users are actually affected by nomophobia? No. Now back to chemistry. Hydrophilic in chemistry means substances that can be dissolved in water. Hydrophilic molecules are also known as polar molecules. So for example, if you add salt in water, It dissolves, therefore, salt is hydrophilic. Hydrophobic in chemistry means substances that do not dissolve in water or substances that repel water. Hydrophobic molecules are also known as nonpolar molecules. For example, if you add any oil to water, It will not dissolve. Therefore, oil is hydrophobic. We use soap or detergent almost every day. Detergent molecules have a hydrophilic head and a hydrophobic tail, allowing it to dissolve in both water and oil. For example, let's add some sesame oil in water. The oil floats over water and makes small globules. Gradually, small globules fuse into big globules. Notice the oil globules do not dissolve in water, but they stick together to have a minimum surface area to water. Next, if you add one drop of dish detergent, the hydrophilic end of the detergent molecules, let's recall that hydrophilic means water loving, they attract water molecules and pushes the oil to the edges of the plate. Ready? Go! In summary, hydrophilic means water loving and dissolves in water. Hydrophobic, on the other hand, means water fearing and repels water. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.